Hopefully you're as excited for this as I am and we are. I know I'm probably more excited than <laughs> Ashley is, but honestly. I'm excited. I am excited. I just, like I said, I am a homebody, so this is definitely outside of my comfort zone. And I love and her for doing this with me. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, Chicklets? How are you guys doing? Ashley's actually on camera. Look at that. <laughs> So uh, we just wanted to record this like quick life update because we have some exciting news. Wanted you to catch up on what's oh, going on with Ashley. This on quick. I'm not a quick talker. I Ashley likes to drag been. things on. So Ashley is going to very quickly update you on life. Ready? Go. I finished my student teaching. I have passed. They said good job and sent me on my merry way. Yay! <laughs> It's exciting. I'm a couple months away from just being done done. I know that I said, you know, I just have my student teaching and then I'll be done. But they kind of threw a few things at me and were like, hey, you might need this and this and this. And I said, okay. And... So now that Ashley's done with her student teaching and basically done with her master's, she's back at her old job at the high school she was at before, uh, doing that for the rest of the year. But she actually has some pretty exciting news about that. Yeah. Yeah. It's exciting, but it's also kind of sad. Um, I put in my notice and I will no longer, as the end of this year, be working at that high school. I will miss everybody. And I'm super, that's like the super sad part because I love my coworkers and I love the kiddos. But it's kind of that it's time to move on and actually utilize the master's degree that I've been working so hard for all these years. It wasn't just a rash decision that we did this on. We've actually been talking a long time about what Ashley wants to do career-wise, utilizing her master's and whatnot. So it's not like just a rash, de rash decision that we're like, oh, I'm gonna quit my job. It's something we've been talking about for a long time and we think is the best for our family and for our future. Yeah. And like- this, I mean, it was honestly, this was the hardest job that I've had to quit. Um, I've, since we've been married, we've moved every like 18 months. And so, except for here, except for here, this is the longest we've ever lived somewhere. And this is the longest I've ever been at a job. And it was super hard telling them that I was going. Um, so since I've put in my two weeks notice, um, James and I have been talking about what would be the best route. Would it be, you know, applying for an actual teaching job or, you know, staying at home with baby chick or would it be substituting? And we've just kind of decided that substituting right now would be the best for our family. The flexibility of it is what really yeah. is attractive. I've, I've been a substitute teacher before and it really was nice. Um, you, you take the jobs that you know you're gonna like and you don't have to take the jobs that you don't like. <laughs> or if there's a week where you don't feel like working, you can take yeah. it off. If she wants to hang out with baby chick or do something. Or if there's something that we wanna do, something important, um, which kind of leads to like the next big announcement for us, which Speaking is- Speaking of something we wanna yeah. do. And important. Uh, because we have that flexibility, both with her future job and my current job, we want to take advantage of this time and this freedom and travel. We've always talked about wanting to travel and going places. And now we obviously don't have the money to do like the worldwide travel. It's like a bucket list to go to, Euro <laughs> to, go to Europe and do that kind of stuff. But we want, what we want Someday. to do, Someday. what we want to do and what I've always thought would be super fun is to do a traveling around the States, around the US. Mm -hmm. So we're currently planning the first leg of this trip. We wanted to split it up because we're not like, insane travel vloggers but we are hoping to do a like two to four week trip traveling around the west coast of the u.s so this right here i'm gonna pop up a map this <laughs> <laughs> i just felt it needed a an extra sound effect yeah. so this right here is our preliminary route of where we want to go for our west coast trip so we'll go up through washington visit my family up there there's some awesome national parks over in like uh, idaho montana like glacier national park as well as we're going to drive down and go through yellowstone and then i think we're going to go down through utah hit up some of the epic uh nature places there 
then go to Vegas to see the Hay Goods again, probably. That's we it. haven't confirmed We haven't it asked them yet, but we but... want to. Uh, also, while we're there, we want to do Hoover Dam. Uh, then maybe head down to Phoenix area and travel around there, do the Grand Canyon. Then go over to California, possibly do San Diego, maybe even hit up uh, the new Harry Potter land at Universal. Say hi to... Say hi to Heidi, uh, Heidi from, while from while they were napping. napping again. Maybe if she has a baby by then, we can hold it. And tint. <laughs> And then just head up the rest west coast doing beaches or whatever we feel like until we get back to Portland. So that is our preliminary trip for the west coast. We don't have dates actually set for this yet, but we're thinking either late summer or early, like as soon as the school year starts, because we want to do this traveling while everybody else is in school. So I know that's a really long ways away and it seems kind of ridiculous to announce it this early, but I wanted to, we've been planning this for months or at least in my head, I've been thinking about it for a long time. <laughs> Years. It's, it has been, so, traveling the US actually has been something I've wanted to do since I think we lived in Eugene. So that's like six years ago or something like that. So we actually have this opportunity now. Yeah, I've been, I've been wanting to travel for a long time. No, I meant since we lived in Eugene. Yeah, we're old. We're old. <laughs> The reason I want to announce this so early is because I want to get your guys' feedback. I want to know where have you- He doesn't trust me. <laughs> Ashley, I mean, neither of us are major campers. Ashley especially isn't a big camper. I'm so... very much a homebody and I'm excited to travel, but like extended travel always makes me a little like- And like I said, we, we want to do this like two to four weeks. So it'll be like a month long trip doing this West Coast thing. Yeah. Uh, so I want to get your feedback. Where have you guys been? Where do you want to go? And where do you suggest we should go? Because we want to know what landmarks should we go to? What uh, tourist or non-tourist spots should we go to? Are there people we should go visit? Vloggers you want us to see? Do we want us to see you guys? Do meetups in your towns? So many questions. So comment down below, let us know. Uh, Cause I'm excited. This is going to be honestly something that we won't forget for the rest of our lives and then the fact that we're vlogging it is going to be even more awesome hopefully you're as excited for this as i am and we are i know i'm probably more excited than <laughs> ashley is but honestly. i'm excited i am excited i just like i said i am a homebody so this is definitely outside of my comfort zone and i love her and for doing this with me <laughs> and and he's talking about like camping and stuff. I think so. it would be cool to oh, be able to camp no. in the back of my Land Rover. See, and, Just that's, saying. and that's like even more <laughs> roughing, roughing it. Like that's yeah, not really even roughing it. I'm talking about going but to campgrounds with bathrooms and water. And <laughs> Actually, one other thing I'm really excited about that I haven't even told Ashley about that I want to do is, oh, we'll no. see what she says about this. But what I want to do also is when we go to these different locations, is utilize these backdrops to do some cool short films. I don't know what the short films would be, but I think it would be cool to do that kind of thing while I do see the fly now, <laughs> to do Thank some of those you. things while we're out traveling around. I mean, how cool would it be to have a short see, film bugging me. or a chase scene or something at the Grand Canyon? You know, I don't, I don't know. So again, the main reason we put out this video is we want your feedback. So please do comment down below. Uh, even if you normally never comment, let us know where you would want to go or where you've been that we should definitely check out. Bye. <laughs> you look like a duck. It's constipated. <laughs> You're not supposed to record it. Thank you guys for watching. There's a up. Quick up pumping. Oh yeah. See you guys tomorrow. Bye. No, I don't know which I'm way so you're gonna confused. go. You're supposed to go when it goes in. You're supposed to go, mm. and then back up. What would you get? Boobs. <laughs> <laughs> that is <laughs> totally the end credit scene. <laughs>